Did something happen? The prisoner has returned. You're in the presence of our master. Stand up straight! The bonds that you have reeled in are quite intriguing. In other words, they all have been unfairly labeled by society and are standing up against such fates. Have you noticed? Your heart seems to inspire theirs. <laughs> Outcasts of society, in other words, your picaresque, deepen your bonds with them. Those will become the strength behind your rehabilitation. I look forward to it. I shall grant you an ability befitting of your newfound growth. Consider it a gift. May you continue devoting yourself to further rehabilitation. You're Sai-san's younger sister, correct? May I talk to you for a moment? Is it about the Phantom Thieves, Akechi-kun? You're quite perceptive. I was wondering if there were any points in common between Kamoshida's and Madarame's cases. There have been victims, after all. The Phantom Thieves need to be pursued. You criticize the Phantom Thieves, yet you don't doubt their actual existence. Oh, you saw that show on TV. Common sense can get in the way at times when pursuing the truth. Many details become logical if I think on the premise that they do exist. Is this because my sister told you to do so? It was just a coincidence. Why do I get the feeling that you're enjoying this? You may be right. Huh? Phantom thieves that use calling cards and succeed in their crime? As the so-called charismatic detective, it'd be hard for me not to see them as my rival. You have such high self-esteem. So the phantom thieves are evil and you are just? Compared to people who manipulate others' hearts as they see fit, I believe I'm on the side of justice. Besides, I'm only using my natural-born talents for the sake of serving the world. Don't you think the same about yourself, too? I... Oh, that's surprising. So, you're just the good girl type of pushover. Looks like it's starting soon. See you later. Give Sai-san my regards. Why does everyone get on my case? Such a delight to enjoy coffee of this quality. You could stay until you find a place, you know. 
I can't promise that it'd be comfortable here, though. Thank you, but I'll return to the dorms. I realized something after talking with everyone last night. Perhaps it's due to my upbringing, but I don't know anything of the world, let alone other people. If I'm to depict people in my art, I need to learn more about them. I must interact with them more. I'll return to the dorms and start over by talking with the people closest to me. I see. Good on you for realizing that yourself. There's no need to exaggerate. May I come again sometime to enjoy your coffee? My doors are always open. He's been through a lot, too, from what I've heard. Are you related to him? Huh? Oh, uh, how would I describe it? We're just acquaintances, not family or anything. I may be overstepping my bounds, but why did you decide to take him in? My reason, huh? <laughs> Probably because he reminds me of my old self. That's all? It doesn't take much when someone takes consideration on someone else. Your art instructor, um, former art instructor, he must have felt something for you too, besides just stealing your talents. Truth be told, I cannot hate him from the depths of my heart, either. I should probably get going. Hey, you sure about this? The painting, I mean. It'd be a waste to keep here. Even if I kept it at the dorms, it'd only be met with skepticism. I doubt it would want that. Adding a hint of color to an otherwise ordinary day. I'm sure my mother would have done the same. I see. I'll hold on to it for you then. Thank you for the coffee. I'll come again. Hey, hey. 